the joint statement by Barack Obama, Nicolas Sarkozy and Gordon Brown on Iran's second nuclear enrichment site was a harsh rebuke for Tehran, but the three leaders will be eager to coax in the other permanent members of the Security Council. Russian President Dmitry Medvedev, in a communique read at the G20 summit, said that the second site caused concern and violated Security Council resolutions. China is likely to provide more resistance, though ultimately it could be a valuable broker. On Friday, it urged Iran to cooperate with international atomic agency inspectors. It also said the group of five plus one talks on October 1st with Iran and Geneva would achieve results, but it has already said this week it opposes sanctions. Germany was quick to chime in with its condemnation. I am extremely worried about the news concerning the construction of another enrichment plan in Iran. By doing this, Iran is once again violating the guidelines of the international community as well as the International Security Council. Iran's President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad said in New York Friday that the U.S., France and Britain would regret their statement concerning the new plant. There should still be plenty to talk about come October the 1st.